to sneak in the question about, uh, will we be seeing you on Justified anytime soon? I am told yes. I am told uh, I will be back. I, you know, I'm the baby mama, so it's, it's kind of hard to get rid of me. Um, I, I don't necessarily, I'm, it's great. I'm so like out of the loop. It's wonderful to kind of just n not know and going blindly. Um, I, I will be back for several episodes um, and I don't know to what capacity, but you know, I'll be strapping on the baby bump. I suppose. <laughs> that's been, uh, that's been a, a big uh, back and forth relationship there. Are you curious to see, you know, what it's like now that she's kind of removed but going to come back into play? Yeah, I'm, I'm really curious to see where they go with this because they have, they have a sort of finite amount of time with me yeah. um, because it's a loan out, basically. And um, I think sometimes with those sort of constraints comes a lot of interesting creative solutions so maybe that constraint can can help m make it interesting I don't know I uh, have to ask on behalf of my wife who really was rooting for uh, Raylan and Winona <laughs> do you think that those two characters that you know even though there was clearly this long attraction like it just was not gonna work or do you think in the long long run there's still hope for them you know I've only seen it I've only seen it work once on on a one-hour television drama where where the 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 two main characters who are a couple are happy consistently and it was Friday Night Lights and that never ever happens outside of that because you have to have the tension there has to be conflict and there has to be tension otherwise there's there's no story for them um, so I would love it if it worked out but I don't know that that happens in TV land 